For nearly 50 years, Levi's have been a name linked with rock and roll, counterculture, and casual fashion. But what steps are being taken by this well-known brand to ensure that their jeans are not just fashionable, but also ethical and environmentally friendly? How ethical is Levi's? Levi Strauss & Co. is an American clothing company known worldwide for its Levi's brand of denim jeans. It launched its most sustainable jean ever recently as part of its Wealth Red collection. The company was founded in May 1853 by Levi Strauss in San Francisco, California. Levi's jeans were first invented in 1873 and are now available in more than 110 countries. The company's vision is to lead the way to a sustainable world by producing high-quality products from recycled textiles. Levi's Sustainable Well Thread Collection is made from recycled denim, sustainably sourced viscose, and cotton. Levi's has also been making better choices over the last few years. It's constantly sourcing more sustainable materials and finding ways to use less water. Well Thread is Levi's most sustainable collection to date. Considering that the parent business, Levi Strauss & Co., forecasted a revenue of $5.8 billion U.S. dollars in 2021, it does not take much imagination to understand the massive global production machine that is responsible for these enormous earnings. The production of goods on such a massive scale is very certain to have far-reaching consequences. The history of denim in the United States is quite extensive. This fabric has been utilized as a tent canvas, in upholstery, in accessories, and in addition to playing an important role in the development of the quintessentially American blue jean and other garments. Denim was used for everything, including the sails on Christopher Columbus's ships. This particular fabric is woven using a special technology, which contributes to its resilience and long-lasting quality. It can be made from pure cotton or a combination of cotton and other fibers. One of the distinguishing features of denim is the peculiar way in which it fades, in addition to the one-of-a-kind threads that are colored in it. However, it is not as clear-cut as to whether or not denim can be considered a sustainable fabric. In 1991, Levi Strauss & Co. published its Terms of Engagement, which included a code of conduct that was intended to guide ethical production throughout the entire supply chain of the denim giant. According to Levi's, the document was a watershed moment in the history of the fashion business and has prompted a large number of other clothing firms to establish similar guidelines. So, does it work? Let's examine the difference between theory and practice. According to a Levi's commissioned product lifecycle analysis, Levi's 501 medium stonewash jeans account for 37% of the product's carbon footprint and 23% of its water usage during customer care. This has been interpreted by Levi's as a call to action to change consumer mindsets away from purchasing focused on quick fashion and to urge buyers to think of Levi's jeans as a long-term investment. So how has this mindset influenced the company's day-to-day -day activities? Levi's has made substantial promises to environmentally responsible denim production, one of which being a significant reduction in the amount of water used. The Levi's company has set a goal for the year 2020 of producing 80% of its products utilizing the water less technology. It has also established a target for the reduction of greenhouse gas emissions by 25% by the year 2020 for both its direct emissions and the amount of power that it consumes. And as of right now, it is on course to accomplish these targets. In their research titled Toxic Threads, which was published in 2012, Greenpeace called out and publicly embarrassed Levi's for their connections to potentially hazardous water pollution in Mexico. Since then, Levi's has committed to lowering the amount of potentially harmful chemicals that are used to dye and treat their apparel, with the ultimate goal of eliminating potentially harmful chemicals entirely by the year 2020. Because of all these efforts, we are able to award Levi's with a score of good in regards to their impact on the environment. Levi's collaborated with RenewCell to develop a new line of jeans called Wellthread 502 that are made from organic cotton and a substance known as circulose. The groundbreaking new material created by the Swedish firm is composed of recycled denim in the amount of 50% and viscose obtained from 50% environmentally responsible sources. The jeans have the look and feel of classic offerings, and they come with a worn-in wash that reveals the denim's shade of indigo, which has a subtle reddish hue to it. The material, on the other hand, is unlike anything else the company in its 167 years of existence has ever made. Most jeans that you purchase today, unless raw, have undergone an extensive finishing process. This uses large amounts of water, contributing to water waste and water crisis in high-demand areas. 
Levi's originally launched waterless technology back in 2011 to combat denim production water waste. To this day, they have continued to use more than 20 different waterless manufacturing techniques, which greatly reduce water usage and produce the same jeans you know and love. Through waterless technology, Levi's has currently saved more than 3 billion liters of water and have recycled another 5 billion liters of water in the production process. Levi's denim is known for its ability to withstand everyday wear and longevity. This is especially important now, as more than 85% of textiles end up in landfill. Levi's has placed master tailors in select retail stores as part of their commitment to reducing the environmental effect of their business. At these stores, you will have the opportunity to speak with a highly talented tailor who will assist you in extending the life of your Levi's jeans by either customizing them or upcycling them into a one-of-a-kind new item. The tailor shop also provides services including decreasing the length of your pants, narrowing the leg of your pants, making waist changes, and even creating handmade custom tailored jeans that are one of a kind on order. Within the tailor shop part of Levi's official website, you'll also find a range of tips that will teach you how to upcycle denim products and add your own unique creative flair to your jeans. Now let's discuss about labor standards. Workers at Levi's are paid a not good enough wage. They received a score in the middle of the range between 41 and 50 percent on Fashion Revolution's Transparency Index since it can trace the majority of its supply chain covering the entirety of the production stage. Despite the fact that this is a move in the right direction, there remains a component of Levi's supply chain that needs additional attention. Levi's has made very little progress towards its goal of guaranteeing that all workers in its supply chain are paid a wage that enables them to support themselves and their families and virtually none of its supply chain is certified by labor standards that protect worker health and safety. Given its huge profits, we think the brand could be doing far better on this front. What about animal welfare? Levi's animal welfare is not good enough. It does not use fur, angora, or other exotic animal skin or hair. Its current animal welfare policy insists that the supply chains for the sourcing of all animal products must be traceable where practicable to ensure humane practices. Despite this, it does still use leather, down feather, and wool without stating their sources, but states it supports wool from non-mules cheap and will work to consolidate its wool sourcing accordingly as it becomes commercially viable. Levi's has continued to be an innovator in producing denim that not only fits perfectly and stands the test of time, but is also better for the environment and our future. When it comes to shopping for new pieces, Levi's have produced the best choice of timeless and eco-friendly denim. Well, that's it from this video. What do you think about Levi's sustainable practices? Do you think Levi's is the best sustainable business in the fashion space? Share your thoughts by commenting below. If you enjoyed this video, hit like and share this video with your friends to help spread awareness. Also, consider subscribing to our channel for more interesting videos every week.